Hi, this is Giridhar from Ponalicious. So today I'm gonna unbox the brand new Moto G, which has just been launched in India exclusively from Flipkart. So I'm gonna unbox it for you and see what's what's uh, what's it got for us. Moto G has launched this phone uh, in India only through Flipkart, and they're gonna set it on for the first three weeks and then depending upon how the business stocks go in other sellers may jump in to sell this uh, Moto G in India so I've got here the 16 GB version and it was uh, one of the hot selling cake when uh, Flipkart launched it so we've got the packing here and this is the Moto G 16 GB it was sold out in a matter of minutes and I was very lucky to get this one for a friend of mine so he gladly let me unbox it and use it for a while and uh, on the launch day Flipkart had some exciting offers so I haven't received the Flipkart flip case which I ordered along with this so I'll be doing another video when I get it and I'll show you how the flip case uh, feels like and how it is so here it is I'm unboxing the Moto G 16 GB version so it's a black color here it is I can find that there is no seal here so I guess only the seal is uh, this loosely packed cover here so inside the box we have the Moto G and the sticker which says Motorola, a Google company. I think it's no more a Google company, it's now a Lenovo company. Okay. And what else has it got inside the box? Interestingly, it's got the headphones and a wall mounting charger and some information pamphlets. So in the US version, you don't get the wall mount, you just get the data cable and you don't get the headphones as well. So and also the US version is a single SIM and in India it's been launched at as a dual SIM version here. So this is a wall mounting charger. So let me go ahead and open it and inspect it first before I actually open up the uh, phone so okay, neatly open it and this is uh, not a data cable so you don't get a data cable you get a neatly designed compact and cute looking wall mounting charger for your Moto G and also a cheap looking Moto G earphones it's made in China so. and this one's let's see the ampere rating in it it's 0.2 ampere I think uh, they're given the uh, lowest end of the charger and Moto G is compatible from 0.2 ampere to 1 ampere chargers okay so let's have a quick tour of the uh, box as well so it's a very small packaging it fits in very uh, snugly with the device and it's very minimal there's nothing much on the corners just for a sticker with the uh, specifications and other uh, marketing details here and it's got the IMEA model number MMRP and the box contents it's, it's just a regular sticker which comes in with uh, any uh, electronic device and at the back we have a little information here like about the quick executive summary of the Moto G and uh, some fine prints about copyrights and certification information there and we have some logos of all the applications which can be used here oh, so that's it in the box let's dive in and call, see what's got what's in the box further we got some quick start guide how to remove your cover back cover 
and let's get started in Hindi and we have the warranty and information pamphlet okay let's toss them aside and see how the device is so it's not a large phone it's a cute and compact design here you see the nice motorola dimple here and have a flash and a 5 megapixel camera at the back and the speaker grills are also on the back this back is slightly curved and it's a matte finish it's not completely rubberized but it's a matte finish here and the edges are slightly on the bulkier side if you compare the uh, moto x or even the nexus uh, mobiles and on the bottom you have the usb uh, a charger uh, in socket and also a mic here on the top you have the 3.5 mm jack and a noise cancelling mic and on the sides you have the uh, power on button and the volume rocker and on the left side there's practically nothing here and let me see how i can open the back cover okay okay I'll open the black back cover here it's plastic it's, but it feels it doesn't feel very cheap and the uh, battery is non removable you would have to insert your sim 1 here and sim 2 here so sim 1 goes here and sim 2 goes here so these are the sim trays and there is no provision for sd card it's a 16 gb version you see here and it clearly warns you that the battery is not user removable so that you don't go and force it out of uh, the body and let's put the cover back and power up the device okay so let me remove the sticker Okay, we've got the sticker of the Moto G and let me inspect the front face. So there's a small uh, lip around the glass. It's a 4.5 inch display here and there's a small uh, lip which you can see here. I think that protects the uh, screen when you place it on some hard surface face down and it's it's very uh, subtle in Moto X maybe you can see that the edge device is kind of edge to edge glass and here we have a small border and a bezel which kind of encases the entire display and we have a front facing camera here I think it's 1.5 megapixel and we have a speaker grill which is not completely black but it's a steel color here steel finish and I'm trying to switch on the device I think they have not charged at all so let me charge it for a while and I'll come back to you okay so it's charged a little bit and have powered it up it says, uh, it's got some nice animation there. Interesting. Just got six percentage, so I would have to charge it further to completely use it. It's recommended that you charge uh, a new device at least three hours. Some people do overnight. Don't do it. Just charge for three hours. migration application there so it lets you transfer your messages contacts your call history your media like your music or video and even some settings this is a proprietary uh, Motorola application there so I'm just going to show you I'm not uh, going to transfer it for me right now so 
okay so you will have to download the motorola migrate application from the play store for, to the other device before you hit next so i'm going to hit back and let me inspect the device so this one <coughs> comes with what version Android version 4.3 and Jelly bean and okay, the dual sim settings are here, which is uh, interesting. So we'll have to uh, set the behavior of each sim so you can actually disable or enable any sim card and you can have the set the data behavior and call settings so which one do you want which sim you want to use for call and which sim you want to use for data and messaging so that's some interesting addition over uh, the US version and we also have let's see what applications that motorola has put in so okay uh, we got the assist application and the regular google application and we have the fm radio which needs the uh, headphones to be plugged in so I don't think the US version comes US version comes with an FM radio application and that's the reason maybe they haven't included a headphone there so we have a headphone here and we will let me connect it and we have apart from the Motorola migrate Motorola care and the home screen I mean the boot up animation there is nothing much customization done it's pure vanilla Android 4.3 jelly bean version here and that's a good thing and we are expecting the 4.4 uh, update to be available for moto g anytime now so on the spec side uh, let me have a quick re recap it's a quad core crate processor snapdragon 400 1.2 gigahertz and it's got 1 gb of ram in there and uh, it's a 4.5 inch display and it's 720p display not a full hd display there and that's it and Thanks for watching the video. So stay tuned for uh, the in-depth review of the Motorola G coming up exclusively in your favorite uh, tech blog, Phonelicious. So thank you for watching the video. Goodbye.